fixing what's broken. Easier said than done, but when it comes to... Hey, is, is everything okay? Baby, it's okay. The, the monk's special because it's sentimental, not because it has the best handle ever. So we're gonna fix it, okay? And we're gonna make it even more meaningful. So I came across this concept called Kintsuki, and it's this Japanese art form where they take broken pottery and repair it with gold. So the really cool thing about this is that it highlights how we're able to turn imperfection into beauty and how some things are even more beautiful after breaking. That being said though, uh, I will probably settle for some ceramic glue. So part of the reason why this mug is so sentimental to me is because I actually got this uh, my first year of college. And back then I was very much a minimalist. So this is literally one of two material things uh, that I actually have from that time frame, minus my diploma and my memories and my friends and relationships and stuff like that, of course. But the beautiful thing now is, is that it actually extends to this part of my life now. And honestly, I'm really proud of the way I react uh, because I'm not so sure if the freshman Jackie would have acted the same way. And uh, now I'm able to add my, my growth, my patience, my reaction, and just a reminder of what's important. Because, you know, things break all the time. Relationships, spirits, things we care about, even things we don't care about. And it's not a matter of if. When that happens, we get to decide how to react. And we can't always control how things break but we can decide if we want to put our heart into fixing what's broken.